in a struggle between the 99% and the 1%. This country was born in the struggle between the 99% You know about Shay's Rebellion? You know about Shay's Rebellion? The farmers who fought the Revolutionary War? The farmers who fought the Revolutionary War! Who got stuck with the war debt and bailed out the 1%? Who got stuck with the war debt and bailed out the 1%? This Constitution was written to keep that rabble down. This Constitution was written to keep that rabble down. And we are that rabble. And we are that rabble. The First Amendment that protects your free speech. The First Amendment that protects your free speech. And your freedom of assembly. And your freedom of assembly. Was written because we fought for it. Was it because we fought for it? Not because the Founding Fathers wanted it. Not because the Founding Fathers wanted it. The Supreme Court was created to protect property. The and Supreme the Supreme Court was created to protect property. We should not kid ourselves that an amendment to the Constitution will stop that. We should not kid ourselves that an amendment to the Constitution will stop that. After the Civil War, we wrote amendments. After the Civil War, we wrote amendments. We freed the slaves with the 13th Amendment. We freed the slaves with the 13th Amendment. We guaranteed equal protection with the 14th Amendment. We guaranteed equal protection with the 14th Amendment. Thirty years later, the Supreme Court said segregation was legal. Thirty years later, the Supreme Court said segregation was legal. We had to fight with a civil rights movement. We to had get to fight with the civil rights movement to get that reversed. To get that reversed. We had to fight with a suffrage movement to get the right to vote for women. We had to fight with the suffrage movement to get the right to vote for women. So passing an amendment is nothing but the first step. So passing an amendment is nothing but the first step. Thomas and Scalia need to resign from this court. Thomas and Scalia need to resign from this court. We need to occupy the courts. We need to occupy the courts. And take back our democracy. And take back our democracy. Occupy the courts. Occupy the courts.